Welcome back to Blue Review. My name is Clinton Yates. Greg out on the golf course today. Plus, I don't know if he wants to be around for this one. Blue Review is presented by Los Angeles International Airport, where changes are arriving daily to help reduce traffic, save travelers time, and transform the travel experience. Well, pretty much the toughest weekend of the year for the Dodgers getting swept at home by the San Francisco Giants, who also passed them in the division race. The bottom line is, the pitching just fell out, in my opinion. This was a series that was always going to be difficult to win from the way everything lined up, and it showed. We're not even going to talk about the lambasting that happened in the middle of this series, which is one of the worst losses you're going to see for a team that wanted to be this good to begin with. Now, this is the first time the Dodgers have been swept by San Francisco in Los Angeles since 2012. And that was in August. So Lord knows what was happening at that point of the season from a roster standpoint. I don't know what to say. You know, my concern was always that what was going to happen with this team was going to be that they were never really going to find cruise control. And therefore, it was going to be difficult to ascertain who you wanted in the clutch moments. I don't think we've gotten any farther away from that. I think it's still very tricky. And I do think that this is a team that's in for a dogfight for the rest of the year, if for no other reason than on numbers alone. The games in May and April count the same as the games in August and September, even if your positions are different. And when you're already behind the eight ball this much, man, is it difficult to come back. So got the halos coming up. We'll see how that goes. But overall, this was a regrettable and a forgettable weekend for the Los Angeles Dodgers, unfortunately. I'm Clinton Yates. This is Blue Review. Thanks again to LAX.